What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? AJ Good here at the House of Masks, where we unbox and review cool stuff almost every single day. And today's video is a very special entry of Monday Mini Unboxings. I hope that you guys are doing well. It's a new week, a fresh beginning. It's starting to get warm out. I've genuinely been in a better mood lately, and I hope that you guys are too. Let's make it a good time. Deal? Deal. So in today's video, we are unboxing something Buckethead related, but this is also probably one of the most random items that I've ever unboxed on this channel, and we have unboxed some random stuff. Uh, yeah. We're unboxing a sun visor. Yeah, look at that. Fucking sick. But what we've got here is my favorite character from Don't Hug Me, I'm Scared, Tony the Talking Clock. And this was actually just cheap, and I thought it was cool, so uh, I went ahead and ordered it, and now I have my own Tony the Talking Clock. Could it be a guitar? So here I have one of the Chipson models. That's Chinese Gibson for all you guitar noobs out there. All right, what we have here is quite literally a candle. See, I wasn't lying. All right, well, in this package we have a bunch of finger puppets. Definitely at the top of the list for weird and random stuff. It is Buckethead related, and as you guys may or may not know, there's a lot of random stuff that comes with Buckethead collecting, and this is definitely one of those pieces. So. We've got this very flat, very large, very skinny box, and we are about to take a look at what is inside. Before we do, should we have a little fun? Play the guess what's inside game? Pause the video right now and give me your best guess as to what could possibly be in this box. No cheaters, and I will know that if anybody aside from the Mask Hunter or Douglas Little over at Drown Boy Productions guesses what this is correctly, that you cheated. And then everybody's gonna make fun of you, starting with me. So yes, go ahead, pause the video, let me know down below what you think's in here and with that out of the way let's go ahead and open her up so as I mentioned before the mask hunter would definitely know what this item is because he is the one that alerted me about them being for sale we have been trying to find these correct versions for quite some time and he was finally able to do so and the listing that he found actually had two of them I made them an offer I ended up getting this cheaper than what they had listed and uh, yeah definitely a weird piece that's going to stand out in the collection it's apparently cemented in this box very annoying but I'm doing my best. What do I look like? Someone that unboxes things on camera for a living? What the hell? All right, and now we get to take it out of the bubble wrap. So, ladies and gents, what we have here is a caution children at play sign and a very specific caution children at play sign. Now these signs themselves aren't that rare. You can find these at Menards, all over the internet, wherever else has them, but finding them in this color, this green is almost impossible. I've seen them in orange and I've seen them in yellow like crazy, but I've never seen them in person in green. And this is very specifically the one that can be seen on stage with Buckethead at a very well-known show. Why was it on stage? I don't know. Was it Bucketheads? Was it the venues? I've never seen it outside of that show. If anybody has any footage or photos from other shows featuring this, we can probably confirm that it is Bucketheads. But it was on stage with Buckethead that entire set nonetheless, so I definitely wanted one for my collection. Like I said, a very, very random piece, but something that's going to fill up some space and look pretty cool and just make people go. Hmm. So yeah, a nice weird addition to Buckethead Land, something that is almost perfect for this little series of Monday mini unboxings. This one isn't physically the smallest thing ever, but it's a pretty minute piece in the grand scheme of things. But regardless, I think that it made for some pretty cool content. It's always nice to unbox something that's just so fucking weird, and I can add that to my resume of weird shit that we've shown on the channel. Today we unboxed a Caution Children at Play sign. So yeah, it looks like it's got the base here, it's got the flag here, and he's just standing there all smiles like, hey, please don't hit me. Probably the same thing that you said to your mom as a child, and the opposite of what I say to your mom as an adult. So yeah, here we've got the other side, pretty much the same. I would like to give a huge thank you to the Mask Hunter for always helping me out. He sent me the link to this, told me to make an offer, and 15 minutes later, I had purchased this item, and now it's in my collection. And uh, between Paleface and Co. and the Mask Hunter, they have already done a lot for me 
this year just in terms of Buckethead collecting, but overall my entire time of Buckethead collecting, all of those guys have helped a lot. So yeah, I will be throwing the Mask Hunters information down below. Make sure to go check him out if you're not already somehow. He has easily the world's most insane Buckethead collection. Just some absolutely unreal items, and he is always finding more and more cool shit. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and assemble this guy. We will add him to Buckethead land. I'll give you guys some nice close-up shots, and that will be that for this video. Thank you very, very much for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed it. And until next time, this has been AJ Good here at the House of Masks telling you to say no to drugs and alcohol and yes to good days, and we'll see you guys later. What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? AJ Good here at the House of Masks, where we forget our intro again. What in the fuck am I doing?